What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Salty. I'm back with another video today. I wanted to show you guys the quickest method as of now. All right, this is the fastest method that people have found so far to take high ground. All right, and it's using the pyramids. It's not the most structurally sound. All right, it's not going to be able to withstand multiple people shooting at it, but it is the fastest way possible to get somewhere quickly all right high in the air all right so anyway i wanted to explain this all right there's so many things that you can do in fortnite um obviously with the building aspect there's a lot of things that you need to do in different situations sometimes you need to build something that's structurally sound again so it can withstand a lot of bullets and you don't get shot out all right i showed you guys this technique all right where it has the ramp wall floor and a ramp again all right it has three layers of protection and um i've seen some comments saying like oh this what a waste of mats and i'm just like ah. I just sigh whenever I see that stuff, all right? There's, again, like I said, there's so many different situations that occur where there is a situation where you need to use this, all right? You have to use this or else you'll shot out and you'll die. So no, it's not a waste of mats. Um, in some situations, yeah, it can be a waste of mats, but there's also a lot that aren't, okay? So I wanna clear that up. Now this one, as of now, I haven't really found a way to make it be able to withstand a lot of bullets, but you know, it is quick. So there is a lot of situations where you just need to be quick and that's all that matters. So here it is, you place a ramp, all right and then you go and place a pyramid again this trick does involve the pyramid so if you guys listened to me back in season three where i was telling you guys to get used to using pyramids hopefully you guys did because here again we have another trick using the pyramid and there's going to be way more things in the future that people find out using pyramids so if you haven't started using pyramids already bind it to something start using them they're really helpful so anyway ramp pyramid put another ramp all right and now right as you get to the top of the pyramid all right like this you're gonna put another pyramid and jump onto it start moving towards the top of this one put walls put a floor and boom all right you can start ramping up whichever direction you want now again there's gonna be people oh, it's <laughs> there's not i could shoot it out so easily again there's situations where it doesn't matter you just need to get there as fast as possible it could be a one-on-one -on -one situation and in most one-on-one -on -one situations people don't have time to shoot it out so here's one situation that i thought of it's going to take a lot of practice let's say someone ramps over you right happens a lot and um, let's say you don't have any traps because you could use a different method of mine now they ramp over you they're on the ramp right here you could jump up put a pyramid put a wall put a floor beneath you and put a ramp here and again, like I said, this is going to take a lot of practice. It's going to need to be quicker than that. All right. I'm just obviously showing you guys slow motion. Put the wall here, put a pyramid here, ramp here, pyramid onto it. And now you have the high ground. All right. And they'll be stuck here. They'll be panicking. They'll probably be doing some other form like this. And um, you can actually beat them to it if you use the pyramid method. Now, again, it's going to need to be quicker. It's going to need to be a lot quicker than what I just showed you. All right, but here it is. I want to show you guys it in full speed. Again, that's not the only situation you can use this. There's other situations where you can use this. And um, like I said, it's not yet the most structurally sound base. So don't use it in a situation where if you get shot out, you'll die. All right, simple as that. All right, so here we go. Ramp, pyramid ramp, boom, boom, boom. All right. There we go. Now we're really high up in the air really quickly. I myself have just learned about this trick, so I'm going to be practicing it, uh, trying to find different ways I can implement it to my game, certain situations where, you know, it just makes sense. And again, guys, like I said, it doesn't take many bullets to shoot down this certain move. That's okay. Like I said, there's different situations where you need to just get somewhere quick. And there's other situations where you need to make sure that you have a sturdy base. Okay. So again, if you're practicing moves like the one I taught you, the double ramp, double floor, double wall. The one where it looks like this. All right. This one is really, really structurally sound. It's going to take four different separate pieces uh, to shoot it down. It's going to take both floors and both ramps or both walls and both ramps to shoot it down. So it takes four pieces to shoot this one down. And um, people say it's a waste of mats. Oh, this is useless. Um, if you are practicing this and you have someone telling you that, like maybe a friend, do not listen to them. They have absolutely zero clue what they're talking about there is a situation where this is handy you could be going against a full squad you could be really high in the air and you need to ramp over to them right the storm's pushing you in this would be the best thing to use it is going to take some mats but it's worth it because you have to get over there and you cannot get shot down or else you'll die so obviously this will be the you know pushing method of choice if you're in that situation also the one i showed you where you are ramping wall put a ramp down like that 
all right this one takes three things to break to make you fall so maybe in a different situation you're going up against two people and you want to just get some high ground and um you can use that one all right again everything has their purpose and everything is useful anyway guys like i said every technique has their purpose has their um spot in the game to be useful so i'm gonna again be practicing this one see different situations that it can be useful in but anyway i hope you guys practice this get it down and are back on the channel when i hopefully find something to even improve this method drop a like on the video if you guys did enjoy subscribe to the channel because it's brand new i'll see you guys in my next video peace out